I think the main challenges can be summed up in the four C's. So we start with coverage. We need universal coverage across the whole of a country, not just the population, but the whole of the landmass. Then capacity. Capacity demand is going to grow and grow. Everybody wants to do more. The public services are starting to talk to the people online using their different mobile devices. Internally as well, there is more demand for video and other services. Look at what you think capacity will be in the future and double it and treble it, and this will be how it, how it will really be. Then capability. There are new capabilities that are required. Public uh, safety operators talking through social media to the public, this sort of thing. Lots more requirement for video, for data from sensors at the scene of a disaster that can be used to assist in decision making. And finally, cost. Cost is absolutely essential. There is so much cost pressure now that the people providing the services who are going to be successful will provide flexible, seamless, capable, services but at a reduced cost and then that I suppose brings us really to a fifth C which is competition. There is competition between the public domain and the public safety domain. As I said these two domains are now talking to each other more than they ever did before. Are they going to be sharing the same networks? If they do share them is there sufficient separation and prioritization to make sure the public safety responders can do their job? These to me are the key questions for the next decade. Collaborative research can do exactly what it says. It can be people from suppliers, from regulators, from governments and from the users talking together, listening and understanding what their common goal is. I think that the European Commission has quite rightly concentrated on the role of users in FP7 projects in, in the, the recent past. They need to do even more. Maybe initiate projects which are simply researched with users and nothing else to really understand user requirements and needs and build them into the projects of the future.